something to uh, to rely on for Paul Ince in this team. Yeah, absolutely. And I think from Redden's point of view, it's about coming and really believing you can get a result. There's no point. You've got to come here thinking you can cause an upset, but you have to go and get after Manchester United. I don't want to see them sort of standing off too much and making it an easy game for Redden. I think with those experienced players in there, certainly. Time last year when they won on penalty, so he knows. He knows what it takes. Big day, as we've said, for Harry Maguire back in the team. Casemiro, such a miss last week in the league game, just shows how important Toby he is for Manchester United. This leg of the League Cup semi-final win over Nottingham Forest. Harry Maguire suspended for that game is back. Marcus Rashford, who had to come off in that game, is Europe's hottest striker right now, looking to make history. Paul in. Lee Dixon knows about winning titles, FA Cups and European trophies. What at the run of the rapid Rashford, almost outfoxed. Tom Holmes, but just about dealt with it. Dixon in the left fullback position, trying to deal with him. Bruno Fernandez has come across too. Away from that first collision. Hendrick, and he was fouled by Casemiro, according to our referee Darren England. It'll be Tom Ince, and it's straight into the Manchester United wall. Rashford looking for Beckhorst, who tried to tuck it back towards Ericsson. Beckhorst has got it again. Looking for some movement, Van de Saka has managed to steer it in through the near post and Bout Veghorst with a delicate little touch. I did have maximised this season. Eriksen looking for Harry Maguire. Find Anthony. Now Van de Saka looking to try and get it back towards Anthony. It was well defended and away by Loom. This has got it again. Rashford and draws the foul. That is going to be a free kick. Eriksen, not bad. It flashed past the upright that Joe Lumley was defending. Yeah, little stones after trying to spend their way to championship success. A couple of hit by Casemiro. And that's a little bit late from Tom Holmes. Rashford punched away, and then Ericsson's effort is blocked inside that six yard box by Loom. Lindelof trying to chip it over the top for Rashford to chase and Rashford watched it coming over his shoulder but Hoylet did just enough yeah. Anthony again trying to bend one towards that far corner he's done that before yeah it was a good run from Anthony because he goes inside and that leaves the space outside him I don't think Eric's right from Anthony didn't quite come off and went back to the goalkeeper was a treacherous one yeah that's the thing when they win the ball back Brought down by Anthony, who tried to square it away, comes back to Veghorst, that's a brilliant challenge. It's a super challenge. Another corner for United. Pushing and shoving going on, which the ref deer was right from Rashford. Anthony tries to size another one up, but this is the target on this occasion. Yeah, Grace can... Trying to get in behind here, does brilliantly, pulls it back. And there's just no one on the edge of the area to get on the end of it. Lurking. And Holmes is there once more. And that course over the top. Hey, Ericsson, hey, they're, they're undoing now. He's found Fernandez. Tries to curl it. And it just whistled past the upright. Well, Rahman gets done down the side. Wambasaka trying to nod it on. There was a collision between him and Holmes. And that's going to be a free kick to Reading. Wambasaka trying to click that through towards Ericsson. It's an easier catch this time for Joe Lumley. It's a good run by Anthony. It's an even better ball. And Bruno Fernandes can't quite finish it off. Oh. On towards Veghorst, who tries to toss it towards the far post. Rashford is there. Was it over the line? He thinks he was. So does the referee. And the hottest striker in Europe right now has a new Manchester United record to prove it. He scores for the 10th consecutive home game. He just cannot be stopped. Going to rule out the goal. They're going to give a free kick inside the penalty area for the free kick against Bout Veghorst. And Marcus Rashford's record goal, if he is going to get it tonight, it's going to happen. Rashford accelerating away. 
Trying to pull it back into the... He's got it, gave it back towards the edge of the six-yard box. They want a penalty here for a foul on Casemiro. Back to Juan Basaka, who's balling towards Beghorst, then to Rashford. Fernandez. And then in towards Eriksson with a little back header. And there was uh, a lot of space for him, but I think he would have pulled. Here's Fernandez down the right. Looking to try and funnel that ball. It's Harry Maguire, who seems to stoop underneath it. This is Anthony trying to chip it back in. Well, he's looked the most likely. Yeah, he has. He's been lively down. Reception when he came in. Oh, here's a chance. Here's a big chance. And almost an opening goal. Get him. Looking for the run of Lucas Schall. This time stopped by Lindelof. Casemiro. In towards Beckhorst. It's hit Tom Holmes again. Well, to the break, it is Manchester United nil, Reading nil. In there, let's do something, get something going. It's very easy for Reading at the moment. Okay, time to join our commentary team for the second half. Lee Dixon and Sam Matterface ready for the action. 26 years. Manchester United have They've refused in the first half. Ball down the middle for Rashford to chase. Points above fifth place Tottenham Hotspur. Here is Fernandez. Points well above Joe Lumley's goal. Casemiro looking for Fernandez. Holmes away. Eriksen trying to risk. Here is Casemiro. It's a lovely ball. It's an even better finish from Casemiro. The boys from Brazil combining to open up the Berkshire back line. Manchester United finally in front. Well, we talked about end product producing something, and Anthony produces brilliant ball from him. Great run from Casemiro. But just look at this ball. Great. Casemiro trying to bend one into the far corner. It's a cup corker from Casemiro. And all of a sudden, Manchester United's quest for cup success is tickling along nicely on two fronts. Well, he looked more surprised than anyone in the ground. I'm not sure he's expecting it from Fred. Fred just lays it off to him. And he's hit it absolutely <laughs> perfectly. Fernandez quickly into Fred! A dash of Brazilian flair from three different players have taken the game away from Reading. A terrific finish from Fred. And without much fuss or flounder, Manchester United... Here to Manchester United. That's a big header. And they are on the score sheet. Amadou Mbengue off the bench to give maybe Paul Ince's team a lifeline. Well, Ten Hag will be furious about that free header. Right on the six-yard box. You see him creeping in in between defenders. No one within two or three yards of him. Ambedkar, who is the most important thing to do with the Parliament, who is the most important thing to do with the writing, who is the idea, is B.R. Ambedkar. After that, it is Bengali New Year 15th of April, 15th of April. After that, it is Good Friday. 